Jerry. Wake up, Jerry. What about we go this way? I know you want to go to the park, but we've got to go on a scouting trip for my silly project on... I don't know, what what would you call it? Abstract? Street photography? Building? Minimalism? What do you think, Jerry? Hmm? Am I boring you? <laughs> Jerry, what am I doing? Even though, in the spirit of like that George Byrne book that I just bought, I want to try and practice that in the sense, but I want to do it like different, obviously. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to copy exactly that, but I want to do it in the spirit of that. And I thought I might do it around the industrial parks, like, and have that gritty type, uh, boring, mundane <laughs> type, you know, uh, feel to it, and I thought, oh, why not try something different, try the mundane, try the industrial park, I live right next to it, so let's go for a drive around there and see what I can find, I brought Jerry with me and we'll go to the park after, <laughs> Jerry, you're going to have to bear with me while I do a drive-by scouting mission for the mundane <laughs> here's an industrial thing you have a look here it's massive thinking might try something there with those busy pack whatever the hell this is this is the place that stinks the whole of Smithfield out I might try to take photos of that that might be a good subject to start off with what do you think, Jerry? Jerry. Yeah, it's handy having a zoom, <laughs> especially from the car, because uh, you always need a good zoom lens to get the right, comp uh, the right composition. This industrial park in Smithfield here is the largest industrial park in the southern hemisphere <laughs> apparently what i gotta do jerry you gotta find the most boring photo i can find <laughs> the boringer the better is that a word you know don't just take a snap of the building that's just too easy <laughs> that's a, that's you know that's the cop out you gotta try and look for structure, composition, patterns, geometry, juxtaposition, that's another one, yeah, it's uh, something like even the simplest of things, for instance, you know, just lines on a, a wall with the right colour, Actually, funny enough, that one reminded me of LA, <laughs> the blue. But also, what was I going to say? You know, like, I know some people were thinking, I mean, that's just arty farty crap, you know, taking a photo of a wall. Fair enough. Even I think that too. Sometimes you want to rebel against, you know, the beautiful. Sometimes you want to take photos of ugly. I don't know, it's just, you know, you want to be different, move away from, you know, the beautiful mountain landscape. I guess it's kind of like rebelling against beauty. Okay. I mean, this is, this is as boring as it gets, I tell you, but... 
why not try this it might be my award-winning photo that goes on to make millions and millions of dollars <laughs> Jerry what do you think of this photo yeah? Is this one boring as batshit or what? Is that you can use your phone as well. This kind of photography. Hey Jerry. Um, you don't really need a zoom lens or anything. You just, in fact, um, a phone is is the best because it's always with you and as you're walking around, not just industrial like what I'm doing, but in the city. You know, you can take those arty farty shots, uh, if you know what I mean, where it's, you can frame it up, and the phones can zoom in as well these days. But for composition, scouting, walking around, as soon as you see, oh, that would look uh, surreal. <laughs> There's another word I can chuck in, um, take a photo of that, or abstract. I think the best word more is abstract, minimalism. Hey, Jerry, what do you think? Hmm? You think I'm onto something here? Or it's already been done? Cherry, it's too hot. Alright, let's go get an ice cream. You want an ice cream? Yeah. Like this here. I like the colours, different shades, and the structure, the curves. Uh, sometimes I zoom in on something like this. myself here <laughs> Jerry yeah but even uh, taking photos of the I nearly got run over there just be careful I nearly got taken I nearly got uh, flattened by a truck keep your eye on the road <laughs> Oh, shit, it is. Jerry, we nearly lost it then. Beauty versus the beast. Something like that. Maybe the, the beauty of nature versus the industrial disgusting shit that I live in. <laughs> well, you know what I mean. Contrast between nature and industrial, I don't know. Help me out, Jerry. Jerry, help me out. What words am I looking for? Now one in lights are flashing down the corner, take control, somebody drew it.